Hey everyone, uh, welcome back. The Watch Dad here. Um, I wanted to make a quick video. Uh, so I saw a couple comments uh, recently uh, asking where I've been and to make some more videos. I, and I appreciate it. Uh, the 12 of y'all that follow me, that's, I mean, that's, that's a little exaggeration. Um, um, yeah, it's just, um, I'm glad y'all missed me, I guess. <laughs> um, so I just wanted to make a quick video and tell you guys uh, what's been up, what I've been doing, um, why I haven't made videos. Um, first thing, uh, wrist check, uh, Rolex sub, ro reference 116610LN. Um, yeah, um, so pretty much, uh, like, like if you follow me, you've known that, uh, I think I last I talked about it, I'm, I'm, I'm in the process of buying a house. We bought a house. So the room I was uh, pretty much making the videos in is become the default room for boxes and stuff. So um, I can't make the videos in there. Um, and I've just been really, really busy. Um, a lot has changed. Um, uh, the last video I actually made of uh, that uh, Seamaster, um, I sold it. <laughs> Um, turns out um, from doing um, checks online on forums, contacting Omega, contacting various uh, vintage dealers, uh, any things like that, um, the watch pretty much lost a lot of its vintage value because Omega had to replace the dial, the hands, um, pretty much I would say all of the internal moving parts of the watch the only thing that um was kept original was the case and the bezel they offered to change the bezel but i said no i'll just keep the bezel because i want it you know the original bezel on it so that being said it, it pretty much hurt a lot of the value of the watch um that being said um it wasn't nothing uh of like an emotional attachment for me with the watch um and and the fact that it lost a lot of the vintage value I said, you know what, let me try to sell it um, um, and try to get uh, the money for it to get a couple watches that I really, really want um, and that I've been looking at. And the wife won't let me buy them, you know, so I needed to kind of have a trade-off. So so I put it on Chrono 24 um, and I just sold it uh, a couple days ago. So uh, that watch is um, the new owner. Funny story um, is... I had, so when Omega first um, sent me back that watch, they sent me back the watch uh, fully restored um, with all the internal, uh, all the parts they replaced in a bag. So I went on to the Omega forums asking questions about the watch. Sure enough, uh, some guy uh, DM'd me um, asking if he can buy the uh the parts that i no longer needed right so i sold him those parts fast forward to to uh present time this same guy happens to send me a message on chrono 24 and i'm like hey you're the guy i sold the the, the watch parts to from for, for the seamaster so anyways he's the one that bought the seamaster um off from me off of chrono so now he's gonna have the whole watch uh yeah to himself so um, happy that he's, it's going to get a good owner. Um, so I'm currently waiting, uh, tomorrow, uh, one of the watches that I am buying with that money is arriving. I'm very excited and, uh, I will be making a video of that watch. Um, hopefully soon. It's probably going to be something like this. Uh, um, nothing fancy because like I said, I don't have space to you know fully light li light up a room and do all of that so so yeah that that's that's pretty much where i've what i've been doing um um other than that um um i will in that video i will tell you uh the other watch that i will be trying to buy um and try to find and get a good deal and to to be honest i got a phenomenal deal on the watch that um that that arrives tomorrow uh uh yeah yeah i'll, I'll it it comes with a bunch of accessories and it's way under what any other of that same watch is going for on chrono so i i'm i'm very happy that that i found this watch and this guy actually um accepted you know um because I, you know, I offered um the, the price uh, of, of of the watch 
and he pretty much said, yeah, you know, um, I'm like, hey, why are you selling this watch? Um, now I'm getting into what I want to talk about when I get the watch. But anyways, uh, I asked him why you're selling and he said, hey, I, I bought it. I bought a, a handful of watches. Uh, um, uh, he wears uh, uh, all, all his other watches way more than he wears this one because they're, they're pretty much the same watch, but of a different color. So he just doesn't want to have it sit and not have somebody wear it. And a nice guy. So I got a phenomenal deal. I'll talk about it when I when I when I do a review or um, a video of the watch. Um, but yeah, um, I just wanted to check in and, and show my face and say uh, thank you for 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 reaching out and, and wanting me to make some more videos. Uh, until uh, the next time. Uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Take it easy.